Hey everyone, it's Anthony. It's really yellow in here, but I don't care. Uh, that's how we do. Uh, today I want to give an update on my BMW M2. Uh, I have some stuff coming in to fix my one guitar. I uh, think I can do that today. Uh, what I'm doing is replacing the strings on it, but the neck is kind of warped a little because of the, uh, I guess just the winter humidity and whatever. Even though I put this thing in it, uh, I kind of forget to water that. But anyway, so I finally, after like years and years, two, 14 years of playing guitar, geez, I finally bought a straight edge so I can straighten the neck like perfectly, not by eye anymore. And then I bought new bridge pins that are uh, brass, chrome brass, and I want to drill them out and fill them with, uh, you see how these have uh, black in there? I want to drill out the chrome brass ones and uh, and fill them with uh, like tusk or bone or something. I think that would be pretty cool. Uh, <laughs> this is all the stuff I have piled up for my M2 coming. So just some like cleaning stuff. I got uh, two boxes of this, but uh, the ceramic coat stuff, uh, diffuser, spoiler, winglets, mirror caps, expel, uh, other winglets, uh, door projector. Uh, I think these are the front reflector delete kit. Uh, these are uh, uh, pedals. These are uh, the black grills. This is license plate. But uh, before I give you an update on where the car is, I'm gonna go for a jog. Healthy Anthony, yeah. All right, let's see how this goes. My legs are still hurting from yesterday. Even though I don't really run that much, I'm kind of out of shape. I just do one lap around this park. But all right, let's get it. Did one lap, now back at the Saab. Do you think I should go darker on my M2 for the windows? I uh, guess you can't really tell here. In like some types of sunlight, you can see, yeah, like directly in, this is 35%. So I don't know. Maybe like 20, 25, 30, I might do. Anyway, yeah, I just did one lap around there. I I probably could have pushed myself towards the end. I want to say I ran maybe like 40%, 50% of it. I don't know. Oh, it's a... Uh, I guess it's two and a half miles. That's what that sign says right there, but I don't know if that means it's a two and a half mile marker or if the whole trail is two and a half miles long. But yeah, what's important to me is that I got out here and I ran two days in a row, so I'm not as upset as I could be for not running the whole thing and not pushing myself as hard as I did yesterday. Yeah, as long as you, I came out and exercised and ran, that's all that mattered. If people get pit bulls for protection and to intimidate other people or whatever as guard dogs and all that, then aren't more people, aren't pit bulls gonna be more wanted when people try to ban them for being too vicious and all that? That's gonna make people want them even more because then that dog is just doing his job better. I actually have the wheels and tires for my car. Uh, there's two more under there. Uh, I think I'm gonna take them off, take the wheels and take the tires off the wheels. Uh, I've had them for sale for a month, month and a half and uh, haven't really had anyone interested in them. So I think if I separate the wheels and tires, they'll be available to more people because I could sell the tires to one person and sell the wheels to another person. And maybe there's people who, uh, who this exact wheel with this exact tire won't fit on their car, but the tires will fit on their, their car or the wheels will fit on their car or something. So, uh, yeah, I think that's what I'm going to do. Uh, 
I'm gonna I'll give you a M2 update uh, before that because I know I've kind of been putting it off <laughs> um, uh, in front of this blue curtain window so uh, I guess that would be better so um, yeah the car was supposed to arrive at the New Jersey port on the 15th of March and it was delayed for some reason and it got there on the 19th but then someone else told me it got there on the 20th so whatever one of those days either to the 19th or 20th it got to the New Jersey port uh, so then I called the BMW genius which is some like hotline BMW hotline and they told me that the car is scheduled to be delivered to the BMW dealership on uh, this Saturday, so Saturday the 24th. Uh, so then I emailed the BMW dealership and asked them. They said that if they get the car Saturday, uh, they won't be able to get around to prepping it until Monday. So it looks like probably Tuesday is when I'll be able to pick up, the, pick up my car. Uh, that also means uh, I might not get it Tuesday because I do have to rent a car so I could drive down there I can't drive my Saab down there because I can't bring two cars back uh, So I do have to rent a car so if the rental place doesn't have a car available that day Which I've had happen in the past uh, Then I might have to wait until they get a car in so yeah, but then after that then I'll stop at Ian speed shop and uh, talk to him and we'll start planning to do the expel on the car and then all those parts that I showed you in the video earlier. Uh, I was planning on putting those parts on myself, but it might be easier to do it while he has it. I don't know if he'll let me put the parts on, uh, put some stuff on myself uh, so we could like tag team stuff or what, but uh, yeah, that's the plan. All right, so I'm going to get these wheels changed. Just as I was about to leave, I got another box in. So let's see what's inside here. It's either uh, clay bars to do my sob, or it's the or it's the parts to do my guitar. And the answer is, it's the guitar parts. So this is uh, a bone nut and bone saddle. And I was going to shave down some of this and make some dust out of it to put into these uh, bridge pins which uh, i try to open these up for you. So this is what they look like, six in a pack, and I got a second pack just in case I screw up uh, these from drilling them out. So uh, also here's my 18 inch straight edge. It most certainly is nighttime now. I dropped off the wheels at the mechanic to pick them up tomorrow. Then I went and got a beer at this one bar I'm like, oh, I'll just have one beer, then I'll come home and uh, edit the video and work on some other stuff. But then I was talking to the bartender, then had two beers, and then came home and took a nap until like eight. And then, no, and then I was on my phone for like an hour and then listened to some music. And then now it's 10 o'clock and I'm editing the video. Then after it's done, I should go to the gym and then listen to the Ethereum uh, court dev meeting. And uh, yeah, that's it. So take care. Uh, we'll see what's going on tomorrow. Uh, all right. Bye. Thank you.